Okay, good morning everyone. Good morning. And uh, this is Buddy from the Dimmon Homestead, Stephanie from the Dimmon Homestead. And we know that we always start these videos with a good morning because that's whenever you see them in the morning. But for us here, we have to wait until the sun is going down in order to walk on this scorched earth that is called <laughs> Texas. <laughs> it's so hot. We're in a heat dome, y'all. Yeah, we've been under heat advisory for like three weeks yeah. now. Yeah, it's pretty rough, but mm -hmm. so the sun is starting to go down. We're going to try and do something with the chickens now that, you know, it's cool enough to be out here. And we had kind of talked about this in a previous video about something we wanted to test. And then as we were cleaning out the laundry room, I found something and I was I like, I don't think that they know what? what we're actually going to be giving them. The chickens? Yeah. No, the chickens don't know. No. <laughs> Chickens don't know for sure. <laughs> I don't know if that the people know. Okay, so a while back we were talking about things that we could do with our chickens <laughs> and we were talking about um, giving them a mister system. Like no, a... we're not giving them a mister system. Oh my gosh. We're giving them a trampoline. Okay. We're not giving them a trampoline. Oh. It's a we're... mister system, guys. <laughs> it's mister system, okay. A misting. Misting, but <laughs> Mr. Mrs. system. Just <clears throat> hear me out, okay? We were cleaning out the garage and I found this trampoline misting system, tra misting cooling system, and it hooks up to a water hose. It's essentially, sorry, it's essentially exactly what <laughs> It's exactly what I was going to try and build, yeah. but it was just in our garage from, I guess, when the house was built and we got a trampoline. No, Jacob gave us this. Oh, Jacob gave us this. Like two years ago. Oh, nice. But we don't have any of those poles. Oh, yeah, we didn't have the poles to put it on. Okay, okay. Yeah. It's all coming back to me now. Um, so Jacob gave us this. You gonna sing the song? No. Oh. Um, Okay, but we never had the poles, so now our chickens are going to... I keep putting this in front of you. <laughs> I know, I know. Uh, so our chickens are going to enjoy this misting system. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do it yet, but I imagine I'm going to string it up um, somehow and attach the misters somehow. It's cool because it comes with like all these little... Tubing things and Some zip ties in there. Yes, and it's 50 foot long. Nice. Well, that's how long yep. is this? 50? This is like no, 25. 20? Like 18, 18 Something. to 20. Okay. So we can probably do like two little rows of it. Maybe down and back. That would be cool. What I'm hoping is that I can adjust these nozzles. To make it not like just be a gush of water and just actually mist. There's gotta be a way to do that, right? Sure, why not? Oh, you can even put them under an umbrella. Okay, let's yeah. get to Yeah, well it. this picture shows people being like pleasantly misted. Yeah, but look at this one. <laughs> this one shows people being pleasantly misted on it. And this one shows a kid being absolutely like soaked <laughs> in the water. Demolished. Yeah. So I guess I can't adjust it. We'll figure it out. Yeah. All right. Um, is there a tool to make holes in the? Yeah. Is this what this is? It's a hole punching tool. Oh, it sure is. Man, I thought my days of irrigation were behind me. No, this is just a starter pack. That yeah. We did. This is just a beginning, yeah. a taste of. What's to come? All right. They give us a little water hose spigot. All right. Thanks, Jacob. Yeah. Two so, years later. I'm going to get started. See how it works. Hopefully, I still have daylight. Yeah, let's get it. Let's get it going. Okay. Okay. Let me read the instructions. For real? Did you throw the instructions down? You don't read instructions of the Typ Denman Homestead. Typical. Typical.
All I need is pictures. You have to cut each individual thing into it. Uh-huh. Oh. All right. Oh, it has little teeth. Look uh -huh. at that. That's cool. It's like those shark bite things. Yeah. All right. Let's get her done. So I took the tube and the little teeth actually grab on pretty well. I just shoved it in there. That's the water hose connector. And now I am connecting the water hose part. This is the end plug. Huh? This is an end plug. Oh, okay, cool. We're not gonna use the whole run, I don't think. We might like the top well, of the run? That we would might. probably be good just to do the top of the run. Like yeah. One little strip. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So that's how that's how that works. And I will get into the coop and start running it. It says to rinse it out first. Really? For any debris. That's what the instruction said. Don't want to? I don't read no stinking instructions. Okay, let's just go for it then. Screw it. But here's what I was thinking, babe. This little thing probably would be good to like come out right here. Oh, in the corner? Yeah, and we just run it and have the end plug down there and then just run it down here and uh, that way we can just pop our little, screw the water hose on right here. Okay. Sound good? Yep. Take you in for a closer look. Hello, ladies and dudester. Okay. Ready? So, show us how it works. We're gonna take this little cutter tool mm -hmm. and just cut. Mm -hmm. And then you take end of your fitting and you slide it in. That's it. And you take the other end, you slide it in here. So those little teeth, like they grab onto. They it. grab. It's not coming back out. Like that's in there. Nice. And we can just zip tie it up here and move on to the next. So we're gonna do two misters per little section of the. Yeah, rod. I might do one right here in the middle, a third. Okay. And then do two, one. Can we make sure these are angled down, I guess? Yeah, I think we can probably manipulate that, huh? Okay, yeah, for the zip tying. I just don't, I don't yeah, know yeah, if they, we... they spin. Oh, they spin? They will spin. Oh, nice. Well, that's perfect. All right. Let's do some more. Make sure they're all angled down. These first two look good. Man, that was fast. That was so fast. I'm kind of disappointed we did not have these for our... 
Yeah, if we would have had these for the irrigation garden, where you just cut and slide them into it. But they're not bubblers. Wow. They're not bubblers. Well, maybe they bubble. We haven't even turned the water on yet. Yeah, let's do it. Let's crank it. All right. Crank well, let's get the camera out of here before we get wet. And then who's going to... Who's going to be the the person to make the adjustments? <laughs> I guess I will. I'll stay in here. You turn it on. You sure? Yeah. You volunteer as tribute? Okay. In this heat? In this economy? <laughs> I have an idea. Okay. Hanging baskets. Hanging baskets? Yeah. Steph said... Steph said, hanging baskets under the misters. How pretty would that be? Oh, flowers. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, let's get you hooked up. So the connection point hangs right off the uh, corner. Over here. Okay, water coming on. Oh yeah. That is pretty cool. Wow, look at that. That's awesome. That's really cool. Oh, I can feel it already. The wind wind blew a little bit of mist on me. They're definitely adjustable. Wow. Feel good? This feels Are you gonna hang out in the chicken run now? I am. Steph's gonna hang out can in you the see it? Yeah. This was such a good idea. I think we need these all over the house. Oh my gosh. Our back patio? Back patio misters? We have enough tubes. Yeah, we do have more. And we but have leftover. We would need another water hose connection. That's it. That's it, yeah. Wow. I want to miss everything. Check this out. I think you should come in here. All right, I'm going to go in there. The chickens came in here to hang out. Oh, yeah. It's working! Like, look. Oh, you can make it, like, more of a heavy? Uh -huh. Oh, this is the trampoline guy. Yeah. Spray. Oh, shoot. Oh, God. Oh, no. Around here, we wet our plants and we wet our chickens. I think this is really going to help. This is awesome. Great success. It's a very light misting. It's just enough to like make you feel cool, but not really make you feel wet I guess hopefully in the heat of the day it just doesn't turn into it just doesn't evaporate as soon as it comes out but this was a really quick project I gotta thank Jake next time I see him because it made life easier for myself and for the chickens I got my 
my shower in for the night. Yeah. Am I misted? Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. So that was a really cool project, and uh, it was super fast. I honestly thought it was gonna. I was worried when I first started that we were gonna run out of daylight, and then just like that, it was finished. And yeah. It, and it's so cool. It took like five minutes. A little longer than five minutes, but yeah, that was awesome. Yeah. Um, our record time is twenty, almost twenty-four minutes. So less than half an hour. That's not bad at all. Mm -mm. Um, all right. And most of that was just talking about it. Yeah. So, thanks for joining on this one, and we'll keep you posted on how the chickens enjoy their mister system. And, I mean, I might be installing mister systems all over this house now because that is awesome, and it feels amazing. And I can't even imagine what it would feel like when it's 114 degrees during the day and we're getting misted. That, oh, yeah. man. And the cool thing is we have it on our timer, so yep. we can set it to come on yeah. whenever we want. All right. Well, thanks for joining, guys, and we will see you on the next one. Bye. Bye.